What's good, people? What's good? This is Caddy Daddy coming at y'all today. Y'all know who this is. All right, so, you know, today I'm here. You see that place back there? I know most of you people know what that place is right there. That's Monroe Muffler Breaks and Service up in East Orange over here by Cross Street from East Orange General. Yeah, you know the place. So, you know, just want to let you guys know. This is... You know, I, I do reviews and everything. You know how it goes. You know what I'm saying? Mostly about food and, you know what I'm saying? We putting drinks up there. But, you know, I'm up here today to let you guys know how places like this would try to scam you out of your money. My wife had a little situation with her vehicle. You know what I'm saying? The car wouldn't start. You know, it had a little clicking noise. We got it towed home last night. We got it, I mean, we got it towed right here last night. You know, so... Anyway, she goes to check on the car, and they tell her you need a starter, an alternator, and a battery. She called me. They make no sense. Ain't no way you need all of them. I heard the sound in the car. It didn't, it didn't make all them noises like that, like it needed all that. Nah. For one, they never even started the car to tell if it needed an alternator. But this is what they told her. $1,200 to get the car fixed. doesn't make any sense got the car home you know what i'm saying got the guy that towed the car over there asked the guy to clean the terminals off because the ter the terminals were corroded the terminals was corroded you heard that right terminals were corroded cleaned the terminals off car started up with no problem wasn't nothing wrong with the alternator the starter it was dirty a dirty battery that cost me nothing. So what you're telling me is a company like this that have people that check your car want to charge you $1,200 to tell you that you need stuff that you didn't need? Yeah, I got, in case you think I'm lying, look at the breakdown right here. You see, you see that right there? Look. Starter, alternator. I, I guess that's the label right there. Yeah, it says customer decline of course i'm gonna decline something i don't need come on come on guys you gotta think about it you know what i'm saying we send our wives out here they go get their cars fixed and everything we we hope that people gonna take care of them. they don't people like this come on so people all i'm trying to tell you is this look more or less you listen to this video make sure you share this video you know because there's a lot of people out here that's they're bringing their cars back and forth, you know what I'm saying? And we're, we're, I'm making this video in the hopes that they would do better, you know, in hopes that they would do better business because, I mean, they've been in the community for a long time. You can't be doing this. I, the old managers, I don't even see them there no more, and I wonder why. But more or less, I mean, come on. That could have been my mother. That could have been anybody. It's my wife, most important person in my life. You know, and you, and you try to take advantage of it. So I'm just thinking about everybody else out here that's, that's coming back and forth, going in and out. You know what I'm saying? They're having car problems and they're thinking they're going to a place that they can trust. That's going to try their best to, to take care of them to the best of their ability. They're not Right now, that's not what they're doing if they're doing business like this. So, you know, I'm hoping this get to the right people and, you know, it uh, help them pull themselves up and do better. But other than that, hey, please share this video. You know, just want to bring the awareness up around here. All right? I love you guys. Back, back to food and drinks. Peace.